Hello everyone, this is Pat from PSA Custom Creations, and this is my new sculpture I just got done making. So excuse how I'm looking, I just got done doing some balding and cleaning on this. I'm actually going to call this one Moon Song. I had posted on my Facebook page, I was looking for a name. While it's easy sometimes to make things, sometimes it's a little bit difficult to come up with a name that fits some of the sculptures. This has a real nice look, nice sweep to it. This upright is actually made from one quarter inch steel, so it's big and thick and heavy duty and nice and beefy. Now I did it that way, so it's got a nice solid look to it. It's going to have plenty of strength to hold the bell. This cylinder is actually from an old welding cylinder, like an argon or a CO2 bottle. Big heavy welding cylinder, probably weighs about 75 pounds. The base weighs probably about 150, 180 pounds, somewhere in that range. Because it's such a big thick cylinder, it's going to have a real nice sound. I'm using my special baseball on a stick and hit it. You can see how nice and clear the sound is, how long it resonates, and then how far it will carry. I've done another video talking about how far the sound carries, so you can look on my uh, YouTube channel for that. Now, I do have a string set up in this so that if you needed to or wanted to, we could actually put a clapper inside of it so that it would have a wind catcher and a clapper. It would, it would have a nice little sound to it. Wind would catch it. Uh, it's not going to sound as sharp because you're relying on a little bit of wind to uh, make, the, make the sound. But this has a real good, nice sound to it. You'll see a little bit difference in the color between the bell and the stand. I made this one a couple days ago, gave it a nice acid wash and a real aggressive acid wash so it can develop this nice rustic look of patina. It's got some real interesting colors and shapes and, uh, and textures to it. The cylinder I just got done cleaning and starting to do an acid wash on it, it's going to develop about the same look and patina as that so it will have a nice matching look to it. Uh, so give it a little bit of time, they'll both look the same or nearly thereabouts. So if you want to look uh, more at this, you can see my it on my Etsy shop. Etsy is uh, the site and PSA Custom Creations is shopping. You can also see this on my website. Eventually I've got to put it on there. I've got so many things I'm trying to do between the fabrication and the, and the website update and everything. So take a look at it. It's a great sounding bell. Let me know what you think in the comments. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and do a quick swap out for a big bell I have here just to show a difference in sound for someone else that was interested in this. So t stay tuned for that. This sculpture normally comes with this bell. I'm just going to put this other bell on there just for looks only and just because someone wants to hear what that one sounds like. Oh boy, this is a big old bell. This bell is actually about ten and a quarter, ten and a half inches in diameter. Big, thick, heavy wall to it. This is also a uh, compressed gas cylinder, but it's big. It's shorter, but it's thick, heavy duty. It's going to have a little bit different sound. I had a little bit different ring attached to the top of it. Let's see what it sounds like. Baseball on a stick. And again, normally it comes with. This cylinder here, I do have this one. I'm going to probably use that one for another sculpture. If you wanted this cylinder with this bell, you'll have to let me know. I'm trying to make another design using this one. Uh, they both look good, sound good, but again, PSA Custom Creations at Yahoo.com or my Etsy shop, PSA Custom Creations. Thank you.